Hey there, I'm Roz Weston. Nothing is better than celebrating your first Christmas with your newborn baby. So tonight, WWE Hall of Famer Trish Stratus invites us to her home for the national television debut of Baby Maximus. Welcome ET Canada to Max's first TV appearance. Let's see if he's awake. Can you say hi to ET Canada? Maximus Stratus was born on September 30th. Now it's the wrestling star's first child with her high school sweetheart, who she's been with for 21 years. Uh. <laughs> Are you trying to take my interview? What a diva. The new mom quickly found out that filming with a baby isn't exactly easy when it's feeding time. Are you hungry? Do you want to eat? <laughs> Taking the lead from other famous moms, Trish did the rest of our interview while breastfeeding baby Max. We thought we would do this today for the cameras because it's so important. It's the most natural thing in the world. This is a very different look for the sex symbol who has graced the cover of over 100 magazines and was recently inducted into the WWE Hall of Fame. I thought maybe the transition would be difficult too. We're like, okay, wow, it's a whole new image. But um, it's just, like I said, it just feels so natural. It feels so right. I couldn't imagine my everyday with, without Max in it. The fitness guru is now back to her pre-pregnancy weight just two months after giving birth. So what was her secret? I started doing 100 squats every day. I'm gonna challenge myself. I'm gonna do 100 squats every day my whole, my, throughout my whole pregnancy. I'm squatting every day. I'm doing my sit-ups with them and get my mama fitness in. And will Max follow in mom's WWE footsteps? If Max wants to be a wrestler, I will be more than happy to support that. The McMahons have told me they're very happy to have him back in uh, you know, about 15 years or so. Uncle Hulk Hogan sent him his uh, big Stay Strong Max photo, 8x10. He has this cute little stool from Edge, his Uncle Edge. And in case you don't know what that means, it meant um, we love ET Canada and thanks for visiting. That's what he said.